two groups five and five and we all have each of the voice parts and each group needs to choose a song and then arrange a song and then we're gonna end up performing it and we're doing this so like we all get experience on arranging but then also like you're gonna be the only person on your part so you'll gain a lot of experience with um, and confidence with performing and we also had to fill out the criteria in the rubric two of them were already filled out and that was song selection and arrangement the two we had to fill out were musical performance and visual performance. And those two, how we sound and how what we do while we sing. And we filled out the different criteria to show what gets you the most points and what would get you no points and how to succeed in this project. So first we need to pick what songs we're going to do. And then after that, we need to get everything we need to start arranging those songs. And then after we're done arranging the songs, everyone will individually learn their parts and then once we have all our parts, we'll start implementing choreo for our performance. I like the jungle music because it's all like, you know, pretty good. I know, I know good 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 so when we were picking our song, we wanted to do something that was kind of like upbeat, but there was like a lot of depth to it. And we also wanted to do a mashup. Everyone like thought of different songs and we put it all in a Google document and then we started voting on the songs that we like to kind of narrow down the list. Um, so far, we've faced um, a little bit of challenge um, picking the songs, like agreeing, but it hasn't been too hard so far. Oliver and Company has some really good music. When love is gone. We need to do this song. We need to do this song. So just brainstorm. Oh, wow. So far in my group, we've picked our song, and um, right now we're working on establishing who's going to have the solo where. So far, we've picked a song. I mean, we just went from a list of 14 or 15 at the beginning of class to having a single song that we're going to just revamp and re-energize um, going forward. So. Our group name is Mini Nice, and we are doing Mini Wish Upon a Star. Our group name is Pascal, and we will be performing When Will My Life Begin. We had a little presentation on how to arrange, like the basics of arranging for acapella music, and like, how to make chords. And how to go from one chord to another so that way it creates a nice song. It flows pretty good. Arranging is when you take a song that you hear and you put it out into different parts for whatever kind of group you want, whether, whether it be a band or a chorus, or in this case, an acapella group. You would take each of the parts and make different lines, such as soprano, alto, mezzo, tenor, and bass, and then along with the soloist or the melody line. Today we're starting our arrangements for our Disney songs and uh, next we're just going to keep working, probably add a melody line, bass line and then work from there. No Flight is an online music writing software that we use to help arrange. Um, you, it's really helpful, you can click in notes or like even press the letter on the keyboard of the note you want. You just set up all the parts and then you can put in whatever you want and um, then at the end you can export a MIDI file which is something that plays somebody's part and you can send it out to the whole group and everybody can listen to their own part. So just a really easy way to get an arrangement done and then get it out there to people. The note isn't like important enough to the chord. Okay. Right now we are in the midst of arranging and making sure everything sounds good, everything flies smoothly, and just making the piece great as a whole. Well, right now we have written the melody and we are trying to fill in the rest of the parts right now. So that's kind of what we've been working on for the past couple days. Arranging as a group can be difficult because everyone has their own ideas and some ideas can be vastly different than others and 
You just have to be able to find a way to put them together and make a great piece out of it. I've learned that collaboration is key, but it is also very hard to do in a big group, and especially in a creative process like arranging where everyone has different ideas. Yeah, I feel like that's too dark. Finishing the arrangement right now, we are just doing like some final touches, like adding some cool chords, finalizing everything. Same thing, we go to export and now we just want to PDF. Yeah. Let's start. What? Whoa! <laughs> you guys, this is like it's coming right. to life now. <laughs> At the moment, everyone is on their own with their headphones in and their Chromebooks in the other room, rehearsing, really just nailing their parts down really, really quickly. It's coming together really well. We started off first as doing it as a group, and then we, after we did that, we split up separately to kind of just learn most of our parts. <laughs> some of the song we regrouped and then sang it again. We all came to the auditorium, my group, and we split up for 10 minutes and we all sang our parts alone with the MIDI file, which is just something that will play your part for you. together and sing it together once and now we're isolating a part that we need to work on which is the end of the song and um, we're all just sitting down and Hannah's playing everybody's part individually on piano. <laughs> Pretty much good Except until measure 50. Measure like, 50? I feel like we know. Oh, for sure, for sure. Now that I see. We're working on um, cleaning up dynamics for the rest of the song, but um, basically, we're pretty much done learning like the notes and stuff like that. So right now we just finished up, we're all memorized and we were kind of working on choreo. Just got our general formations for choreo down and I, I think that that's pretty much where we're at. Right now we're doing choreography. We finished kind of like the musicality aspect and we're just putting it, uh, putting visual aspects into our project now, which is fun, which is why we're in the auditorium we're presenting tomorrow. Right now we're finishing up choreo and working on memorizing a bit as we just get ready for the final performance. Started out a little rough, but it's coming together now. Had to uh, redo a lot and like fix things and rework things, but throughout the whole thing it's just gotten better and better and now getting towards the final steps. Some moments in the beginning, but we overcame them and we are doing a lot better than we were in the beginning.
Yeah.